Thanks to L.D. Stemler's request, I made some frozen-inspired nails. Thanks to Chronically Smarifa's request, I'm making these frozen-inspired nails public. Here's what you'll need to create this look. Best thing about it, no actual painting skills required. Which is good, because I can't paint worth sh**. Let's start by putting some white on the nail around the center. I've got cheap old gel, so I'll be doing two coats. Then put a little blue on one side. Clean off the brush a bit and grab some blue on one half of the brush and white on the other, like you see here. Doing these two colors together will help create a gradient on the nail. I then went back with the individual colors to help intensify the outer edges so the gradient is more noticeable. When I realized the colors weren't getting any more saturated with my cheap gels, I gave up, threw on the glitter polish, flipped my table, broke a couple windows, set my house on fire, went to therapy, realized I may have a bit of a short temper with a hint of anger management issues, and then came back to put the nail in the lamp to cure before beginning the second layer. Second verse, same as the first. Put on some of one color, and add some of the other color. Grab both colors on the same brush, perform witchcraft on the nail, make that bitch Elsa jealous of your magical prowess, add some glitter gel, thoroughly admire your work, and cure that sexy beast. Once it's cured, add some clear gel or polish and begin placing your cellophane pieces along the glitter gel side of the nail. I then brought it up around the top of the nail as well. The idea of this was to kind of create the illusion of icicles raining to the ground, striking your foes in battle below, dealing 2d tens of piercing damage, flanking bonus, fuck yeah there is, sneak attack damage, throw 96 because you're a boss level 17 rogue who don't take shit from nobody. Once you've placed all of your pieces, put it in the lamp to cure or let your polish dry. When it's cured, you can clip off or file the overhanging cellophane pieces. Next, I'm going to take some glitter gel and apply it all over the nail where there's no cellophane. You can skip this step altogether if you like. I just have a severely unhealthy glitter obsession. Toss it in the lamp to cure. Once you add your top coat, you're finished. Time to light some candles, ladies. It's showtime. If you were hoping this whole video would be laced with cheesy references to the movie, sorry, that ain't my style. But I do hope you're able to gather up all that disappointment and let it go so you can join me next week. Don't forget to show me your work on Twitter and Instagram, and subscribe to be among the first to see my new videos. Till next time, get off your ass and go create something.